Hello everyone, I'm Dr. Adeline Tang from University of Malaysia, Sabah. This video clip is to continue my discussion of digital marketing. And then for this topic, I will talk about Instagram. Okay, I will talk about Instagram in this video clip. All right, what is the learning outcome for this video clip? First, you must understand the use of Instagram for business and learn how to improve the effectiveness of Instagram. All right, let's look at some example of Instagram here. All right, first, for example, Apple. They are using these to post many different pictures, Lego and Nike. So you can see they post different things, but this is one way to engage customers. Okay, why are we using Instagram? All right, one of the reasons of using Instagram is because we want to target young adults. The user of Instagram, up of 55% of the user of Instagrams are young adults below 30 years old. All right. So if your target customers are young adults, then using Instagram is one of the very good platform for you to, to get into your targeted customers. So when we are doing Instagram, using Instagram for business, remember there are a few important things you have to bear in mind. First, the Profile the bio, uh, profile of the Instagram account is one of the very important thing for customers or audience to know us. So when we prepare the or uh, we when we have our profile, make sure it must be designed to public, assigned to the public, and then describe your information in detail. Provide information such as a uh, phone number and website for customers to get in touch with you. And then how to make use of Instagram? Very easy. Continue posting. Consistent in posting. Post every three to five times a week. Okay. Remember, the more you post, then you will get more attention. And then track the number of likes and comments. And based on these likes of comments, you know who the audience are. And then at the same time, you know what kind of information they prefer. And then you can post more this type of information and then when you post it always remember to choose the right time to post is it in morning it might be lunch or it might be in the evening so you must choose the best time to post so that people have time to to read your instagram and then use hashtag to suit your product the suitable hashtag is very important for your product okay so i have some very important tips here five tips okay. Five tips first, create engaging and quality posts. Your post must be something that relevant with beautiful picture and then user are engaged or like to comment on your post, then you will get more feedback. All right, so that is important. Your, your post must be something that customer or audience like to see or like to share. Post consistently, always remember when you, you engage with your customers, they prefer to see more photos or more information from you. And next, third, build relationships with your followers. Respond to your followers' comment and or on somebody's photos and when you are tagged in the photos. So, so this is a way to make sure they, they can get in touch with you. Post consistently your, your brand. All right, make sure they do remember your brand and then post at the right time. Like I say, you might post it during the in the morning or during the lunch, lunch break or in the evening when people are free to read your Instagram account. So there are four types of content in the Instagram. First, uh, we call it feed content. That means you post, uh, upload photo or videos for people to read have a look what you are doing or to just get engagement for people to watch. And then view five time videos. Okay, you can have podcasts and then through that you can get more uh, response like this. Okay, people might want to see that. And then also you can use Instagram TV to share up to a 60 minutes video that you create for your products. And last, Instagram stories. You can upload photo and stories about that and then it might disappear after 24 hours and um this you also can use polls 
also way in a creative way to create more feedback for your Instagram account. All right. So always remember, like I discussed earlier, okay, when you are you want to share photos or pictures, make sure the image must be unique and original. The picture must be clear, beautiful and elegant, and it might tell some story about your product. Okay. Another important term things in Instagram is the hashtag. All right. Already remember hashtags is for building your brands so that people will get into your brands. Okay. Get new followers, new people to look at your products and check and select followers. So you will get the right audience. If you use the right words, you will get the right audience. And then for brand awareness, always remember if you want to create awareness for your brand, then your hashtag must not be used too many terms. Okay, up to 20 hashtag is good enough, but not too many. And make sure the hashtag is unique, trending, and general that everybody like to know. And then last hashtag will increase the likelihood of being featured and being known by your audience. Okay, so we have to know whether your Instagram marketing is effective or not. We look at something important from the Instagram first. You can look into your feed uh, response, okay? The inside of your content you feed from the past two years. Which type of feed got more response, okay? The story, what type of story people would like to see and promotion that people might uh share more or tag uh tag more to the all right next we can look at the activities here who uh how often they visit your websites okay uh, how often they create your website link email and call then how often they get your information this will provide some feedback to you to know whether your instagram account is effective or not all right and Next, you can look at what are the other activities, uh, the performance and influence of your Instagram account by the reach and impression. Okay, how many number of unique accounts seen your post? How many of people seen your post? And then impression, how many posts has been seen all the time? All right. And last, the audience. This is a very important part. Okay, because Instagram also provide you data on who are the audience okay for example you can see other followers gender okay uh, where are they are they from malaysia are they from kota Kinabalu? all right and then their age all right you can see the next slide okay who are the more common people who want to watch your your instagram okay are they male or female all these will provide information information for you to know who are your audience and based on this based on this actually you can get more feedback on uh, you can get more response and then you can choose what is the best method to do your next marketing all right so okay for for the uh for this video clip i will stop here for, for more information, please look at the Smart UMS website or go to my Schoology account to download this um, PowerPoint slide. Okay, for my students, for my APK students, please, after you watch all these video clips, please go to this Schoology account to do the recap questions on these topics and then you will get your attendance marks all right please do the recap questions to get your attendance mark thank you very much for watching this video clip thank you